tough, but as I say, hopefully we'll be too strong for, for anyway. Fingers crossed as the teams have made their way out onto the pitch to do the handshakes before we get underway here at the Bet McLean Oval and both sides are, are unchanged and a very positive result during the week there, Colin for Neary's. They picked up their first win of the season and a surprising one against Glen mm -hmm. Throw in for Neary, deep in the Glen Thorn half. Hughes. Has it inside the box, out to Mona Goose. Ball into the box, it is. It's a header by McGovern, and it's just over the crossbar. I thought, actually, Reese Marshall defended really well there. You know, he he didn't get himself in a position where he was going to win. He need more runners off the ball um, into space and see if we can create a couple of chances. And as I say to you, try and get this elusive first goal. Kent wins the ball in the air. Hughes. Up now to Ford. Can he hold it up for his side? It does well, Larkin Ford. And it's a poor tackle there by Ford. And uh, yeah, a, a yellow tackle. card for Ford. Yeah. And there's a bit of pushing and shoving going on now. Yeah, it was a poor challenge. I mean, uh, I'll be honest with you, it looked like a yellow card to me. But you, you wouldn't have argued that the referee had to give a red card there. It was a poor challenge. Marcus was already committed to the, the challenge. And, and, and um, he's just come in and had him. Um, right in the shin there, it's a sore one. So You could just bring Bobby straight on, but I'm sure Mick will have a plan here. And see him already talking to the bench there to try and work out if he does come off what we're going to do. We don't want to be down to 10 men for long. All right, Marshall. Rory Donnelly. Ball into Marshall. Can he get across into the box? He does to the back post. McManaman's there, header down. Donnelly off oh. the line by Darren King. You know, he done really, really well there because Connor done well to, to, to keep the ball alive at the back stick, and then um, Jay better come. Well, he goes McGuire towards Daniel Hughes. McLean just gets his body in the way. Turns back to the keeper. Carry. Oh, and that's a poor tackle oh, by Ford, and he has to go, he's surely. Be sent off, surely. Second yellow for Ford, surely here. Doesn't look like it. That's a poor tackle, very late on McCarry. I think he's pleading his case here, and the referee's having a, having a good think about it. Um, I don't I think he's going to get a final warning here. He's found himself very, very fortunate because that was a bit silly, to be honest. I mean, He'd every right to chase Iron down for the ball, but I mean, it, it was clear Iron was going to clear the ball well before the tackle came in. Uh, and honestly, precarious position with the yellow card. He put a tackle like that, he can find himself very fortunate to, to still be on the pitch. Very disappointing not to see a, a card for that. It's one of them ones later on in the game, you can guarantee that. Listen, uh, uh, absolutely enormous. I mean, Norman Kelly, our under 20 manager, I'll, I'll be quick to tell you that the gap is massive. and. Um, you know, Jordan will, 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 will be frustrated playing in the under-20s and want to play Premier League level. And honestly, do him no harm. Poor down to good club and he'll be well looked after. McCartan skips past two players here. Shea McCartan, left foot, has a go. And it's wide of the post. Absolutely nothing wrong with that. Great play from Shea. I mean, it often gets criticised for having a go, but why not? I mean, he, he, he took that. Uh, and he'll be delighted with how Newry went about the first half, the stifled uh, most of our attacks. Uh, and defended very uh, well, and he probably would just say to him, "Look, when we when we get the ball, just try and keep it a wee bit better." All over towards the right hand side, McManaman and Donnelly have changed wings. This second half, Carton back to Connor McManaman looks for the ball to the back post. Jay Donnelly's there as McGuire comes. It's dropped for Murray, and it's blocked oh. by Martin. That was it, you know, that was a chance there, a big chance. Um, I think it just it came to Murray just unawares there and he, he's just tried to side fit that in the net and maybe he took a touch and, there. Um, hopefully find the net soon. Marshall, out to McManaman and it won't be one now with Healy gets past him onto his right foot, ball into the box, Donnelly's there oh. and somehow doesn't get his head onto it. It was a whisker away, wasn't it? It was a great ball in. Great piece Carton of into the box, That's tackled there by Ford. Referee says, get up. This referee is absolutely in the process of having one here. I mean, that was a clear penalty. To tell you the truth, I watched him close there. He didn't even see it. He was a mile away from it. Uh, and again, hopefully these decisions, won't, won't we won't be ruining them at the end of the match because there's a, sh a blatant red card and now a penalty. 
lively enough start to the second half anyway. Yeah, great start. Kicked away by Dale Montgomery. Murray has it. He'll have a shot. He has a go and it's over the bar. Yeah, listen, never criticise anyone for having a go. But Quite receive it from Bobby Burns. Yeah, but we've got to keep making runs. Got to keep shifting their back four. You know, make them t t take on runners, make them um, mark runners, because if we don't, you know, we'll find it very hard as, a, as the game drifts on to get a go. Carton. Runner players. It's past it. Moan. Plays a pass for Bobby Burns. Ball into the box. There it is. And it's oh. a poor enough delivery as Maguire Gallers. That, that was a brilliant piece of football. I, I love to see that. I love to see Shane McCartan. You know, he's a great dribbler. He dribbles really well with the ball. Loves to take players on. You know, at the end of it, it's usually a shot. This time he, he, he played it in to, to Bobby. Lovely, lovely pass. Great ball in by Bobby. Not too much wrong. And again, another wee half chance for us. Montgomery driving forward with a pass now out to forward up against Bobby Burns. Back to Moon. Ball into the box. Bobbles about and it's tipped around the post that was a by great McCarry. Save. Great save to be fair. And it'll I mean, be a rare corner for Neary. Yeah, it was a great save. I mean, he, he saw that very late, to be honest. It was a, it was a good a bit of incisive play by Neary. Moon put on a, a, what I thought was a lovely ball. Defended very stoutly today, hasn't he? He's, been, he's played very well. The entire nearly back four is done rightly, but as I say, we've got to find a way of breaking them down. Philip Donnelly for Neary. Tackled there by Marshall. A go by Lockhart, tipped over the bar by McCary. <sighs> Seen that coming. I mean, he, 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 it actually, ball broke to him on his right foot, and you could see he was trying to shape it just onto his left, and it was only one. First kick up towards Lockhart. Coming together there from Burns and Plum. Burns now out of possession is Ford. Will look the attack down that right hand side. Ball into the box. Donnelly's there, heads it, goal works, but it's just wide of the post. Yeah, we can't become complacent there. Skin. Today there's you been just, great balls into the you box. I would love to attack it, honestly. I would love to play to Shane McCartan as deliveries are. First class. Ball. Ali Roy is on side. Ali Roy, can he have a go? Does indeed, oh, and it's a weak really effort unlucky. by Ali he was Roy. Really unlucky there because he, he, he delayed the shot, yeah, sucked the man in, and just. Oh. Wilson. Fian will give it to Singleton to see if he can pick a pass. Great touch by McCartan just to keep it. So tight, that good pass yeah, to right Jay Donnelly in the box. Donnelly one on one into the box, it goes oh, and somehow dear. Ali Roy hasn't scored. I think it was behind him, and we're still there. And it's in, Same. and it's Bobby Burns from left back has put the Glens 1 0 in front. Didn't think the ball was ever going to go in the net no, there, Colin. You were, you were starting to think there, maybe it's not going to be our day. Just a wee bobbles, wee bounces weren't going for us, but finally, and luckily, uh, you know, it's a great piece of play. Fair enough, uh, it's second phase there, and we get a wee bit lucky, and Bobby. Um, <laughs> Johnny on the spot and puts it in the net and won the up and um, we've got to build on this now and as I say don't give Nuri any any cause to get back into the match keep them at bay and, and see if we can build on this and get a few more goals very good move as well, in well the build brilliant up. move and listen it's, it's look, I'll be honest with you I think we definitely deserve to be ahead in the game there's no question about it but sometimes these games you know can drift on and drift on and you don't score thankfully we have here and as I say hopefully now we can build on it and and just quell any threat you already have and, and, and collect the three points that's really important for us today. Definitely, and, and we sort of said that as soon as we get one, hopefully two, three follows. Keep pinging this ball about, and I, I think we're well deserved to be in the lead here. Now you can see Daniel Hughes putting a bit of pressure on that's the keeper. It. We're it's changed now because now they are starting to press from the front, where before they were they were very happy just to let us have it, weren't they? And, and, and bring uh, move us up the pitch now. They're, they're pressing all over because they know you know, as I say to you, 10 0 one 0 still going to leave with nothing, so... Wilson with a clip pass and to McManaman. McManaman does well, good use of his body. And onto his left foot, whips it into the box, Lovely Sally ball. Roy's there, goal! Oh. It is a goal! Ali Roy at the second time of asking, 
Good save initially by Maguire, but Roy finds the net, and there's the second. Yeah, it was a brilliant piece of play there. I mean, Aidan and uh, Paddy McLean have, have sent that ball out to Connor all day long. I told you the fullbacks are, I think, nearly fullbacks. Any criticism of them are very, very weak in the air. Uh, that ball's played in. Connor takes him on. Gets it onto his left foot, whips in a beautiful ball. I think Ali Roy was very unlucky not to score the header. I thought he took it very well. It was a great save. And thankfully for us, he, he, he has the wit and the wherewithal to put the rebound in. 2 0. Game over as far as I'm concerned. It's a master stroke by Mick. Two substitutes. Master scoring. stroke. That's <laughs> what we said at the time. Absolutely not averse to those substitutions. Um, you know, just to give us a wee bit more impetus, freshen it up. Uh, as I say, the two boys that came off, you couldn't be too critical. Really good put performance as I said really really encouraging start to the season uh, I think all Glenman everywhere the, the leagues are target this year and you know can ask no more at the moment we're, we're, we're going to be top I would assume after the results today uh, and it's a great position to be in just heading into what's going to be a very tricky September Marshall across to Burns Burns out the Ali Roy on the touchline back to Burns goal scores linking up ball into the box blocked and it's away we're a corner. Yeah, we're no rush to take it. And as I say, really good, good, good performance and for played in Uri for their, their first half performance. I think, as I said, yeah, tiredness got the better of them there, and we, we've exploited that tiredness and scored two really good goals. And I think are well, well deserving of a, a victory here today. Cartons and ball in the box. McLean's there, and it's a goal. Okay. Paddy McLean on the score sheet makes it 3 0. And that's another great ball into the box, this yeah. time by McCartan. Listen, we said it earlier too, you know, uh, no, no, and I don't mean to bring it up again, but Tim has come in as coach there, and I know he focuses on set pieces, and you can definitely see, you know, a turnaround because most corners we've had here, we've looked at threat there, and yes, albeit you can say it's the last couple of minutes and Yuri maybe switched off. But it was a great delivery, a good run by Paddy McLean, great header, uh, and the keeper had no chance, 3-0, uh, and as I say, great performance, great three points, and smiles all round. After the Pet McLean Oval, McLean torn three goals in front against Newry, three second half goals. Yeah, it's been a great performance, as I said, really, really great, and, and, and as I say, you know, give the players credit, the, they've stuck to their task here, they could have got frustrated. Carton driving forward here. Yeah, he's brilliant, brilliant. Plum, he'll have a go. Cuts in, oh, outside of the foot. See if I I'd love to see Shane McCartan and Connor McMahon run that. It's, it's very, very. Back it goes to Scullion. The Healy. Thielen now has it. Kips the ball out to Moan, who's offside. Yeah, it's offside, Darren. Um, you know, the, the Tim Marshall does blow his full-time whistle 